Vajrasana. This asana should be performed in a meditating pose. While performing this asana in a meditating pose, one should keep their eyes closed. To perform this asana, you should first come into the Dandasana pose. For this, you have to sit with both your legs stretched in front of you. Keep your hands close to your pelvis. Be careful that the weight of your body is not on your hands. Now bend your right leg and place it under your right buttock. Then bend your left leg and place it under your left buttock. Make sure that your thighs are close together and your toes are touching each other. Now keep your hands on your knees. Make sure that your chin is parallel to the ground. Keep your spine straight and keep your body relaxed. Now breathe in and breathe out normally and stay relaxed in this posture for some time. Bhadrasana makes the muscles of your thighs and calves strong. This asana improves the digestive process. Vajrasana makes the nerves of your legs strong. This asana gives relief from the pain in your lower back and sciatica. Vajrasana gives firmness to your spine and helps to keep it straight. Please avoid doing this asana if you are experiencing pain in your knees or have injured your ankles. People suffering from piles should avoid doing this asana. After staying in the Vajrasana pose for some time, bend your body to the right while straightening your left leg and then bend your body to the left while straightening your right leg. Now, relax in the Dandasana pose. Doing Vajrasana regularly strengthens your body and improves your concentration. It also gives you peace of mind and rids it of stress and pressure.